good afternoon children once again welcome to online class so i have started with the biology lesson that is conservation of plants and animals so today's topic is flora and fauna mm, so in the previous videos i told you all about the deforestation consequences of deforestation and all so today i am going to teach about the flora and fauna flora and fauna are nothing but the trees and animals varieties of animals and varieties of plants and animals which live in the biosphere reserve biosphere reserve consists of flora and fauna now let us see what is flora and fauna panchamuri is an example in the last video also i told you all panchamuri is in a uh, space where uh, it is uh, taken as an example for biosphere reserve so if you go to biosphere reserve you could enjoy flora and fauna you know flora means plants and the trees and fauna means the different types of animals living in that area flora means the types of trees and the fauna means the animals the plants and animals found in a particular area are termed as flora and fauna okay so uh, for example flora means sal trees teak wood jamun silver ferns and arjun these are the some trees uh, which you can take it uh, as uh, flora fauna means animals different kind of animals like uh, uh, bison uh, jinka blue bill parking deer cheetah leopard wild dog wolf these all comes under fauna so now we are going to talk about the endemic species this is all about flora and fauna what do you mean by endemic species endemic species are these species of plants and animals which are found exclusively in a particular area they are not naturally found anywhere here and there they are found only in exclusively area okay those are called as endemic species means uh, they may be particular type of animal or a plant may be endemic to that zone or a state or a country so we call it as endemic species endemic species means a species means same group of plants and uh, species of same uh, means animals of spe same species okay so these are called as species of panchamuri panchamuri biosphere okay so here also some examples i can give trees like sal and wild mango these are these comes under this endemic species whereas in animals i can give you as uh, some examples like bison flying squirrel flying squirrel uh, the squirrel which is having a big fluffy tail okay so it is very big in size and it is having fluffy tail so and uh, giant squirrel that is also one type of squirrel which comes under this endemic species okay these kind of endemic species are becoming very less because of deforestation due to human desires okay so to preserve these all the government and ngos have set up this type of uh, programs like uh, national park wildlife sanctuaries and biosphere okay children animals this kind of animals and plants are preserved here so these are also called as endemic species what are endemic species endemic species are those species of plants and animals which are found exclusively in a particular area okay they are not naturally found here and there means they are not found anywhere anywhere else like okay they are particular type of animals and plants okay they should be endemic to that zone or a state or a 
country so those are called as endemic okay children so i hope you have all uh, written fa1 exam also and submitted the papers and those who have not uh, submitted the papers please come to the school and submit the papers and uh, assignments of this fa2 i have sent in the group hope all the children have got from the class teachers so please write those all assignments in the ruled sheet paper and bring it for the correction when you come to the school i hope you have understood this uh, about the flora and fauna and endemic species in the next video i am going to continue with the same lesson okay children thank you